morning everyone welcome back to the outpost we thought we would stop and take a little bit of a break and eat a sausage biscuit that I stopped and picked up this morning I was running a little bit late so I just decided to go ahead and do that anyway we're glad that you had time to stop by and hang out with us here while we're uh, trying to finish up the handrail the outdoor kitchen is looking really good so we're gonna go ahead and uh, cut up this tomato yeah I'll tell you what these homegrown tomatoes I guess it's, I don't know, the other ones that you buy in the store, they just don't seem to have, I guess, acid is what they're missing because they don't have that that tangy flavor to them. But these homegrown tomatoes, they are just something else. There's one. Well, if I can get it up here. I don't know. You don't want one? Okay. All right. There we go. Look at that. That just makes it more better <laughs> anyway all right we'll get this eight up and then we'll meet you back over there on that second handrail
Well, my niece Wendy, which is Kyler's mom, brought us a sack lunch. Got some cheeses, candy bars, oh my goodness, pop tarts, chips, and a ham sandwich. So I've got a tomato here that I'm going to cut up and put on there. But um, so we're going to take a small break. As you can see, we've got um, the top portion up of the handrail. And we've got the bottom plate just lying there. So what we're going to do is we're going to pull that out. We're going to drill the holes in our spindles. And then I've got a corner post that needs to go over there because, like I told you before, I'm going to have a countertop that comes out with a cabinet. I guess I'm going to go ahead and make a cabinet. Um, so I'm going to have to have a corner post there. And then I'll have to set another one over here by the fire pit. But um, that way it will already be done. And uh, so it won't be long. We'll have another handrail across the back. And then I'm going to take my time about building that cabin because I cabinet because I really need to get back on milling siding for the cabin. 
because um, I've been working on this about two months now, but this is going to be a really nice place to come up here. I'll put the table back up here. I'll be able to cook, hang out, do some projects if it's raining or something like that. So we're going to go ahead and eat a bite, and then we'll get right back at it. Thank you. 
Well, and then the rain came. So we decided we would sit it out maybe, let, see if it'll pass. Maybe 30 minutes or so, and it'll pass. But yeah, I'm glad we got this up here. Makes it look a whole lot better. Not that I was really worried about it, because primarily it's just me up here anyway. But uh, it makes it a lot sturdier. Well guys, the sun did come back out, but I also see dark gray behind that, so it may rain again. Um, but it did cool it off a little bit, but I can feel it starting to heat up again. So I think we're just going to go ahead and call this a day. It is late afternoon, um, not quite evening yet. But I think what we're going to do, he suggested it, uh, sort of. Um, but if he's not busy tomorrow, we may jump over here and go ahead and knock this countertop out. Um, and then if we did that, actually, the kitchen is pretty much done with the exception of the earth oven. But I'm not going to tackle that anytime soon. Maybe this fall or maybe next spring. But um, I do have a barrel that goes in this corner that's got a hand pump on it. So I was telling him that we got to make arrangements to cut out the countertop put that in there. That way I can actually have water up here. It's a 30-gallon barrel. 
And uh, so that will be nice and it'll drain into a five gallon bucket that I can dump over the edge. Um, and then the rest of it will be, I think I'm going to put one shelf in there, but that'll be a place to put pots and pans and different things like that. So I think that that is our plan for tomorrow. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video on putting this handrail up here. This makes it really nice and it is so stout. Um, I did take that draw knife and knock the corners down, which, I mean, they weren't bad, but um, it just makes it feel good. And I do have a hand sander. I think I'm going to go ahead and bring it up here at some point and just do the whole top of it right here. But anyway, glad you all had time to stop by and hang out with us up here at the outpost while we're doing some work on the homestead. We greatly appreciate that. All of y'all, we can't thank you enough for supporting the channel. Anyway, we want to wish everyone a great afternoon. Take care, and we look forward to seeing you back up here again next time.